Hey everyone, Merrick here. We're back in the wonderful world of Universe Sim, and there's been an update. We're now on version 0 0.0.4.160. .0 oh yes, they've added a lot. A lot has changed. They've fixed issues where resource piles of construction sites were not visible, fixed an issue with the news log window that caused the constant flicker. Oh god, I'm so glad they fixed that. Uh, fix performance issues when dragging the UI windows, reverse the scroll bar and the farm panel crop, good. Fix an issue that caused tooltips not to fade away. They've added some new content, settings panel. Um, they added this. Yay, look at that. We can actually adjust settings now. Woohoo, volume sliders, wonderful. It's about time we had volume sliders. Not all the buttons work. You can't cancel out, you have to hit escape. Obviously, the patch notes button, which I never noticed before. It may have been there, but I don't think so. Um, worker's ID card font fix. Don't know what the problem was there. Main menu population icon has changed. It's now a, uh, a city skyline kind of thing. Um, the Atlas upgrade and optimization, 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 um, maximum fertile, fetal, fertile females at a time has been raised from two to three. That'll help our growth. Um, maximum carry capacity has been upped. They're still balancing. Stamina has been upped. Um, yeah, so a lot of balancing patches. I'm not going to read through all of them. Uh, the day night cycle has been changed and bonfire disabled for future balancing. And a bunch of smaller edits. So let's go ahead and place our pop center um, right here. Yes. And let's see how we start out. Um, two babies, two people. Pretty standard. Uh, as of lately, we're gonna have you do the uh, stone and you do or the food and you do the wood. And let's go to the research panel. Oh, it's not the new panel yet. Well, poop. Okay, well, we're going to rush, um, let's see, um, we're going to go straight for stone gathering, follow it up with timber cutting, and do that. Oh, we have a zoom now, and keyword searches, clothing, search, nope, N um, Cook. Search. Okay, searching doesn't work. Escape key never worked for that screen. And we're back. We're back and we're, we're going to be building. My population is two. Apparently children do not count as population, which is how it should be. You never know if they're going to make it. They could just die on you at any moment. And that's just the way it is. Sometimes you just got to die. And so we don't have any kind of uh, defensive structure to build. So one less building to build, I guess, is a good thing. Um, I guess I could actually just say, you know what? Let's do some, some stone gathering next so that we can build a stone hut for your kids to grow up and bang in. You know, like a, like a, like a proper family. You know, first you're going to cut down some more trees. So I had... Had a lot of fun with Tree Bear in the last episode, but I think this episode, since we've had an update, we should focus, just laser focus, and, you know, not fixate, because it's time to, to you know, utilize our extra fertile females and, and improve our civilization size. That sounds just so wrong, but it's exactly what we need to do. Now, these two little bastards are about to grow into full-grown adults, and we can get our four our full four panel force going on um, ASAP so what are you doing? Are you dropping food off? Alright look at that now we have a builder and a wood gatherer get to work you little shits it's time to build uh, oh I love babies I want one of those you just were one you whiny little turd bag why don't you do some work before you're like, I'd like to have a baby. Oh, I'd like to have a civilization, but all I get is these whiny little shitheads wearing leaves. Ah, <sighs> well, you know what they say, you can't always get what you want. But sometimes in the future you'll have god powers where you can kill people. Um, we don't have the god powers menu right now. Which is, which is sad. Can't see any of that. 
Oh, look, a log panel. <gasps> oh, it's great. It doesn't flicker. Oh, no real announcements or anything yet. But that's wonderful. Oh, that makes me happy. And now we are building... Um... Wow, look at that. You can click on it and see what it's doing. Um, it doesn't tell me... Oh, I'm clicking on the resource. Oh. Stone stockpile, wood stockpile, food stockpile. That should be like baby stockpile. She's building a house. That's a flower. Um, so it's only things that we've collected that we can click on and get stats. Which is fine. It's absolutely fine. I really can't wait until we can get boats and go sailing and... and um, stuff. And if you want a baby, you're gonna have to bang your brother to make a baby. Alright, that's, that's pretty much how it is. Yep. Do a little dance, make a little love, create a baby. There he is. There he is. Um, just, just shat him right out. Got him a little leaf and everything. Wish he'd get to work, but instead, no child labor for us. So they're gonna go bang in their parents house. I think their dad is still in there. Um, I guess he's gonna record it in finger paints for posterity's sake. Yep, he's like, oh, no, I'm not into that weird stuff. They brought in a pineapple. I don't even know what you want to do with a pineapple. So, you know, he, he's out. He's not he's not gonna have any of that kind of foolishness in his room. So, <laughs> his one bedroom rock pile. So, yeah, that's that's happening. Um, Builder's Hut. Can we build that yet? Can we have builders now? We can. We're gonna queue it up. Queue it up? Okay, we're getting there. We got better stone collection. We should have better wood collection soon. Um, and we'll get this Builder's Hut built after she finishes her house, which I don't know where she went. And we have two kids which are gonna be our builders, I think. So she's got her hammer, she's gonna finish her house, she had to look up at it and go, Son of a bitch! Where did I get that log? How did I know how to stack these like this in order to make scaffolding? I don't know. I just I just know this shit. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna move these rocks around a little bit, and then I'm gonna have all sorts of stuff I never gathered. It's gonna be amazing. Because Lord Merrick said so. And as soon as she gets this done and starts building that, the two kids will grow up and kick them out of their house. <laughs> That'll be the way that goes. Oh, we're, we're in winter. Did I go into the South Pole again? Or the North Pole? No, I'm... Yeah, I'm at the equator. I should be at one of the poles. Okay, well, if you're a big nugget now, start construction. And the other one will do something else. Congratulations, you have a house! I'm really glad you imported some dirt. And a mammoth skull. Yeah, drop it. Drop it, there you go. Oh. They, are they gonna do it, or are they gonna build a house? Or the constructor hut? It's hard to say, honestly. My nuggets are a little weird. But I love them anyways. Because they're the best nuggets. Okay. Did you guys finish it? Where, where'd you go? Where the hell did they go? Somebody's getting a beach house. A floating beach house, but a beach house. Oh, they went to bank. Okay. Well, you're a big nugget now. I guess you should collect food. I wonder who gets the beach house. That's kind of awesome. Alright. Well, could you hurry up? I know you're having fun and all, but we, we've got things to see. Things to do. You know. Really need to... We really need to finish this constructor's hut. Guys. There you go. He was just like, I'm done. Back to work. <laughs> Worked you over, now I gotta go swing my hammer. And I ain't talking about my junk. Yuck, yuck. 
<laughs> okay, so we're building the constructor's hut now. Which is good. I should have um I could be I could take off one of the workers or the constructors and put them in the constructor's hut. And they can do repairs and build. And and one of the builders can start these houses that are that are um over here. There's only one house, right? What is this two? Is that just decoration or is I think that's decoration for this house? They have a huge yard compared to their parents. Ungrateful little shits. Okay. Swing your hammer. Finish this off. It's almost done. I mean, look how close you are. Why would you stop to go pick your nose? Just finish the damn thing. I got I got workers to, that need work. You're holding up the economy. Can't have that. People are about to start dying. I mean, I realize it's it's 7 at night, but, you know... I don't care. Work faster, work longer. I'm just gonna have to work it. What are you guys doing over there? Nothing? Okay, yay, it's done! Okay, so we can pull one constructor off there and put them in here. Okay, and then when this nugget grows up, we'll put them in there as well. And then when we have the third nugget born and grown up, we'll put that nugget on the construction team. And then cycle them out like that. I'm going to avoid farming because it still doesn't produce enough food to really matter. And we're just going to go for how big of a population we can create. I really think that the growth curve is probably... What are you doing? Stop it! Stop it! Stop dancing! They're still dancing! Ah, <sighs> that was annoying. I'll um, put him on there, and then the next kid that we have, he's he's banging because he showed his hot, you know, tree moves. Um, the next kid we have will go into one of the other jobs. I swear, this lady is hooked up with more than just her husband because. She was working and banging with that guy, and now she's working and banging with this guy. Are we just town bicycling this thing where everybody gets a ride? Is, is that how we're doing this? Because, I mean, it, it, I, I don't mind because we need to make the babies, but it's getting a little weird. And where did these trees come from? They weren't there before. And ha that's floating. You know what? I'll allow it, because it's a cool-ass beach house. How do you even get in? Oh, literally, you have to go under the water. But it's okay, they got the whaling spears. <laughs> the whaling spears. Nobody's, nobody's doing any whaling. This is a really cool fucking shot, though. Look at that. That's a cool little shot of our, our, our place. And space in the background. And just the horizon, just lumping. I can't really say it curves, it just kind of lumps along. Ah, oh, we got another stone hut complete. Look at that. Everybody has a house now. I'm so nice. We're building another one. Um... Do I want to build a warehouse for stockpiling or anything like that? Nah, not really. Kind of just want to finish these, these texts related to, um... Improving our building and repairing. Just kind of finish out this entire tree here. And then let it ride. See how far we can go. See what this rabbit hole does when we get all up in it. All, all deep inside of it. Can we harvest these trees? Like, they have fruit on them. Can't we just harvest those since we're magically creating fruit trees? I think we should be able to. Oh, it's raining. It's. R I wonder if there's gonna be like floods and shit that can happen. That'd be kind of cool. I mean, we're not in a floodplain, but like up in the mountains, just like flash floods. That would be awesome. Well, I think it would. My nuggets might not think it's, it would be awesome, but I don't care. 
Um, you are going to be a constructor because somebody apparently died and I wasn't paying attention. Um, nobody died. I don't know where my other constructor went, or maybe they're in the process of dying. Maybe their job is currently to die. Let's see, do we see anybody just kind of zombie walking? Oh, there we go. Yep. No, he's fine. You tricked me. You were just standing there eating. You lying sack of shit. I don't know where the constructor went. We lost somebody. Lost in the wilderness. The hut's fine, though. What are you doing? You're eating. Okay. Uh, we got another stone hut. Wonderful. You guys need to make some more babies so we have a use for it. One, two, three, four, five, six. We got six stone huts. That's enough for twelve people. I have eight people. Maybe instead of building stone huts, we should be screwing. What do you guys think? Time for some banging? Um, no, we're just we're just gonna bang some rocks together. He's gonna build this stone hut without any of the supplies. Good job. I don't even know how he did that. That must be our messiah. Oh well. He's he's gonna build those huts. I do love this. I think they've added more stuff. Look at that. We have made a permanent skid mark on this planet. Right in the thighs. Right between the thighs. Just there's people. It's big old we got the dingleberries here and we got the little turd colony growing. And, you know, the rest of the world is just sitting idly by watching us devastate it. At least that's the way it's going to go in the future. Right now, you know, the world survives us. In the future, probably not so much, if I'm going to be honest with you. I'm, I'm going to, I'm going to be pretty rough on the, on the whole, the whole, uh, keeping the planet alive thing. This is a whale with whales in it. There's the tail, there's the fins, there's the head and the body, and then there's actually a whale inside the whale. I see what you did there, developers. It's Whaleception. Mwah. Very clever. I like it. And look at this guy. The person that lives here is just like, Man, I just hate everything. I hate the world. I'm moving out. And then just like moves just slightly over over the hill. And then he still comes home to have his laundry done. You know, to get the fresh leaves from, from mom and dad. God, mom, you just don't understand. I'm an artist, okay? No offense to anybody that's an artist. <laughs> um, We have... An Ida worker who wants to chop wood. Wonderful. And then we'll have two more Ida workers who want to um, do other things. We've got our two builders repairing, which is good. Don't need to build another hut. They can handle the repairs. I really wish they would split the work up instead of, you know, tag teaming things. I kind of feel like she followed him over there and he was just like, God, leave me alone! And, and now she's just following him and he's just like, Jesus, I just... I wish they could just be alone. You know, we're, we're a civilization of eight. And I really want some me time, okay? You're smothering me. <laughs> existential crisis! I don't really know if that qualifies as an existential crisis, but that's how I'm playing it. That's how it's working for me. And are you, do you guys repair this house and are you going to bang in it? I don't think anybody actually lives there. I don't really think there are assigned houses yet. Which is a little sad. I think there should be. I think you should have to sleep outside till you get a house built. Alright, two more people. Woohoo! Um, we don't really need another food gatherer. We need another constructor. Because we always need more constructors. Without constructors, 
nothing gets built. So we're reaching about the 20 minute mark, which means the AI is going to start going potato any minute, unless they've like tweaked that, and I'm not sure if they have or not. But I'm looking to see if we've got anybody doing the zombie walks. It doesn't look like it yet. Um, but pretty much around 20-25 minutes, you, you start getting the zombie walks, you start getting bodies laying around. We definitely have less bodies than we've had in the past at this point. I mean, we're doing a lot better from the whole, you know, let the bodies hit the floor thing. I'm not sure what to do about that, actually. Guess we'll just let it roll. See what we can do. For a little while longer, at least. Maybe they stabilized it a bit more. Maybe it's getting to the point where I could do that weekend long play and just make one really giant episode full of just awesomeness. What is... What is this little gold particle effect. Is that supposed to be snow? I don't think that's snow. I don't know what... Oh, they're fireflies! Okay, they're supposed to be fireflies. They're not coming from the clouds. It's just dark. It's a dark summer night. And there are fireflies. Fair enough. Got another construction site. I mean, we are building like mad. I love it. But we're not really banging like mad. We've only got one kid right now. We definitely need more kids if we're going to do this right. Big time need more kids. Okay, so they're building that. Probably shouldn't have done a third builder. Do I have three builders? I think I only have two. Yeah, I've got two. It's okay. Two is a good number for builders. And we got two repairs. They are kicking ass. Um, seriously, I'm, I'm surprised nobody's dead yet. Age two, she's mating. No kids, age one. Stone hut complete. Age nine, where, like, are they dying without telling me? I think they are. Either that or they're just not aging the way they're supposed to. A day is supposed to be so much older than that. Elu is 14 now. Or is she 87? Where's Elu? There's Elu. Still working. Yeah, she's 14. Three kids. I mean. I don't really think that like the, she's dying age yet, which is crazy because we've been going for. I think this this balance or this change has probably unbalanced the game a little bit because we are going we're going to have a massive workforce at this point. I'm not saying that's a bad thing. It definitely increases how long you can play because the AI doesn't go potato until you have a whole bunch of dead people. And we are definitely stripping away the resources, as you can see. You know, we've we've basically removed all the rock from this way, all the way to over here, and we're we've stripped all the forest back to here, and we're stripping away the rocks over in these rock piles now, which I think is awesome. And she's going through a stroll on the beach. Surprised that leaf is staying on gathering stone and resting. Are you trying to gather this stone that's in the water? Oh, you're not trying. You're doing. Look at this. That is some te telekinetic shit I did not, in, you know, imbue her with. Evolution is real. They've evolved the ability to mine rocks underwater. <laughs> that was awesome. Underwater mining experience. Check. Okay. The dawn of our new civilization, we are... It, 
current year one? That's not right. Um, so that is not the first year. So there's a calendar bug going on. And we've lost somebody. Our total, our total worker pool has gone down. Does that mean somebody died? Am I not being notified of, of people dying now? Um, yeah, Elu died. Okay. So people are dying and how old was she? Is she still in my list? Oh, they disappear from the list. But she was like 14 or 15, so apparently the age in which you die at is a lot younger. Yep, we just lost another one. Um, a day has died. So age 14 is about... 14 or 15 is what they're getting to now. Oh, uh, that sucks. Um... Huh. Well, I wish they'd repair that building. Uh, Epicenter's building... Epicenter building's condition is bad. But they're working on it right now. Aren't they? Or is that the epicenter? I think that's the epicenter and they're not working on it. Um, let's put you straight into repair mode, please. I don't know if that works or not. But I worry that the, con the condition's going to get really bad and it's going to fall apart or something? But they've been... all three of them are working on this. If there's a lady in there... She's dead. So there's a dead lady in there and they're hitting her corpse with a hammer forever. So as you can see, the, the AI has gone potato about where it usually does because they're just repairing this forever. That's great. And they have no spouses, which is always good. Oh, there's the zombie. So the corpses are now showing up in, in high quantity here. Shay is dead. Um, I can't even click on that one. I don't know why I'm over here now. Okay. Oh, double clicking on something locked my camera into some sort of weird rotation thing. I'm not sure how that happened, but okay. Oh, I did it again. Double clicking on her locks my camera into weird rotation mode. Let's see. Yep, there we go. Alright, locked my camera, or the planet to my mouse, or the camera to the planet, or the camera's rotation to my mouse. Either way, that was strange. I mean, it looks like we have a great growing and thriving civilization. But it's a damn ghost town. We're down to eight people now. Most of these people don't have spouses. And we're not making any babies. So we, we've hit that mark where the game is just kind of like, Alright, well, you know, uh, afraid it's going to have to end. And I'm just like, but I want to keep going. I want to I wanna bridge the poop, the poop smear over here completely. And the game cares not for that. Cares not for it at all. So our population is 259. We have 8. And it says 259. So are there... Are there other groups living on this planet that I don't know about? I don't see any well you know I'd like to know if there were others yeah, no there aren't any others this is kind of cool though look at this we have an island just the tip just the tip so no the answer is we do not have another civilization just kind of hanging out 
It's it's just us. And yet yeah, somehow we have a 275 population. Somebody must have died, or 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 maybe one of my bill. Ooh, the giant herd of mammoths! Look at that. I haven't seen that yet. Last time I saw a bunch of mammoths, they were all dead. Cool. All right. So mammoths have the same problem everything has on this planet. You're basically toast. So, I mean, we, we've built just a massive amount of buildings. And yet everybody's dying. So my thoughts are our population capacity is what's influencing that number. And um, we don't actually have the population for it. And also, our, our repair state is just god-awful, because these guys are definitely not their parents, and we're down to one on everything. Oh, we have an extra person. Uh, yeah, go there. So there we go. A lot of, um, a lot of changes. We're definitely able to build much more quickly. A lot of the UI fixes are really, really nice. Um... I think a lot of this stuff is definitely a good step in the right direction, but they have a lot more steps to take. I would really like to see them expand on the AI's capability, um, really break that 20 minute mold in the next couple of updates. Not mold, but limit, I guess I would say. It's not a hard limit. I mean, you, I could keep this running for as long as there are people to, to bang, but it's obvious that the progression has stopped. Um, the intelligence of the AI has basically broken down to build faster than you can repair and we don't have enough population to actually support the colony and in fact we are going to eventually hit this tipping point where we'll eat through all the food or the AI will just stop eating altogether. I would like to see them break past this barrier of 20 to 30 minutes of gameplay and really iron it out so that you could do a balanced Stone Age civilization for, you know, an hour or two where you can sit down and um, just build a Stone Age. I don't want them to add another age yet because I think this one has a lot more work to do. I would just like to see the tech tree fleshed out a little bit more and the um, the AI set up so that it knows how to manage uh, the population better. It knows how to it, when to make babies at a higher rate and um, when to prioritize certain tasks such as eating over sleeping or eating over doing a construction task and things like that. And that may be in here to some degree, but I think it still needs quite a bit of polish. Um, so yeah, I, great work. We got a lot a lot more to do, and I can't wait to see it. I'm still loving this game. Um, it might go back to a um, you know once every two weeks thing. I don't know yet. I'm running out of things to do in here. Um, and, and things to see. We do have a lot of patch content that I think we might be able to, f to, to finagle out of this in the next episode, but other than that, right now we're just waiting on the developers. So I hope you guys enjoyed this episode. If you did, leave a like. If you have any comments, suggestions, anything you want to see me attempt in this game in a single episode of 20 to 30 minutes, throw that in the comment section as well. And of course, if you enjoyed this and you haven't subscribed, consider clicking that good old subscribe button and YouTube will let you know when I get fresh content out. All that being said, I'll see you next time. You're dead. Oh, there's a bunch of dead mammoths. They're all dead. What is this? Is this wolf killing the mammoths? Or is the wolf here to just deliver a message? You fuck with us again. We'll kill the rest of your family, eh?